It's almost winter break. Jingle bells, jingle bells. This teacher is ready for winter break. Hey guys, thanks so much for stopping by my channel today. Today is an exciting day because today we have our faculty Christmas party and I'm going to take you guys along with me. I will also be showing you what I'm putting in my students' treat bags for the holidays. In my Dollar Tree and Target holiday haul, I showed you the stockings that I picked up for my kiddos, but today I'm actually gonna show you what I'm putting inside. Also, I'm doing a giveaway, so be sure to keep watching until the end of the video. Okay, so our faculty holiday party is not until five o'clock, so right now I'm going to take you downstairs and show you some of the things that I'm putting into my kiddos holiday treat bags so let's go oh my goodness guys the snow from yesterday has piled up so much like I literally can't even open my front door my husband is out there blowing the snow let me see let me show you guys this. Like, oh my gosh and I have a package I can't even get it oh my goodness Crazy! That thing was covered! Oh my goodness. So, my husband's blowing snow. Hopefully that loud noise doesn't interfere with my treat bags video. I'm sorry if you can hear that in the video. I'll try to make sure that you guys can't. But I have everything already spread out in the living room on the carpet. That's probably the mess that you saw in there. That way everything is kind of easy to see and you guys can see all of the things that I'm putting in my treat bag. So, let's get to it. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of show you everything that I have laid out for our treat bags. This is not everything, and I'm sorry, my dog Chief is trying to look outside. He hears my husband doing the snow blower, so I apologize for that if you see his little paws walking around. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start out with the treat bags. Now, most of this stuff my mom purchased from Dollar General or Dollar Tree or Walmart. So anywhere that you can find a bargain, that's where she was shopping. So these treat bags have little penguins on it. So they're not really Christmas specific, they're just kind of winter. And then, of course, she got some little snacks for my friends. They love snacks. Any kind of candy or snacks, kids love. And over here we have some little bracelets. These are holiday colors. I think the kids will really like those. Now, we live up north, so my mom went ahead and got us some things that the kids can use when it's cold outside. These are mini tissue packets that I think the kids will absolutely love. There are all kinds of different characters. That way, each child will get something that he or she enjoys. All right, then, of course, she got them some fuzzy socks. We were going to get them beanies, like little hats to wear on their heads, but... A lot of them already have those, so we went ahead and went with socks. The next thing that we have are these adorable little notepads. They are penguins, and there are different colors, so the kids always love those. I will be adding pencils to my treat bags as soon as I get to school, but for now, they'll just have the little notepads. But they will have pencils to write on those with as well. She also was so sweet and gave them chapstick. My poor kiddos have had such chapped lips recently, so those will be fantastic. They've been asking me for chapstick every day. We've been using kind of a community Vaseline with Q-tips. So for those new teachers out there, that is definitely a trick. Just keep a big jar of Vaseline inside your classroom with some Q-tips, and that way you're not double dipping and people aren't sharing germs. So just something to keep in mind. Okay, so once all of the treat bags are completed, I'm going to string a ribbon and a tag through these little Christmas light bulbs to tie up my bags. I'm going to use them with these tags that I found at Target for, let's see, $5. And there are 50 in here, so I can use these for other things as well. Okay, once all of the treat bags are completely finished and I was able to tie them with ribbon and ornaments and their tags, once I have added the things that you see here along with the things that I have at school, then I will go ahead and put them inside their stockings and I will change out this tag with a tag um, that says their name and Merry Christmas. If you haven't watched my Dollar Tree and Target holiday haul, I explain it a little bit more in there, so go ahead and check that video out. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish putting the treat bags together, at least for what I have for today. I will add the pencils and my goo and kaleidoscopes later on, and then I'll show you the finished product on the day of our Christmas party, which will be on Wednesday. So stay tuned for that. Once I'm done with the treat bags, I'm going to show you what I'm doing to get ready for our faculty Christmas party this evening, and then stay tuned for that giveaway. See you soon. Okay, so these are part of our outfits that we're going to be wearing to my faculty Christmas party tonight. The invitation said to dress ugly. However, I wasn't very pleased with any of the ugly Christmas sweaters that we saw. So we went ahead and picked up this green shirt. We found it at Goodwill for like $3 for my husband. And it's actually a woman's shirt. <laughs> 
don't tell. But we're gonna add some fun suspenders to it using some ribbon and some pom-poms, and I'll show you guys that in a minute. With these ugly socks we found at Target, the elf hats we found from Dollar Tree. Over here we have my outfit that I found at a store called Gordman's, here where we live. And basically it was just already done. It was already made up. I just bought the socks at Target to go with it. Over here I have some materials that we're gonna use just to kind of decorate my husband's sweater to make it a little more festive. We're gonna use this ribbon that he found at Dollar General for suspenders. And then he also found these ornaments at Dollar General as well. They're mini ornaments that we're going to hot glue on. I already had these red and green fun pom-poms that we used for arts and crafts in kindergarten last year. ugly sweaters to this party, but we didn't have any luck finding ugly sweaters. So, so. we're full blown elves. <laughs> for watching today. I hope that you had a lot of fun watching us at our Christmas party and got some good ideas for your kiddos treat bags as well. If you are already on your winter break, First of all, I am so jealous, and just keep these ideas for next year. If you're not on winter break yet, this is something that you can kind of throw together quickly if you're still looking for something to put together for your kids before they leave for the holidays. So please leave a comment down below and let me know if this video was helpful for you. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if it was. Okay, so I do have a quick giveaway for you guys. I just wanna say thank you so much for those of you who have subscribed to my channel and who have been sharing my videos. I really appreciate it, and I really feel like I'm being helpful in some way so thank you if you have any other ideas for me please leave a comment down below and let me know what videos you would like to see as a thank you I am doing a Christmas giveaway and today I have in this little box that says may your days be merry and bright I have a $15 Target gift card Target is one of my favorite stores as a teacher and I shop there all the time and I know a lot of teachers can probably use some things from the Target dollar spot or just from Target in general for their classroom in order to be entered for the drawing you need to do three things number one you have to be subscribed to my channel so that you don't miss any future videos. So go ahead and after this video, make sure you click that subscribe button. Number two, you need to leave a comment down below letting me know what you put in your treat bags for your students for the holidays. Or if you don't do treat bags, what do you do instead? This will give other teachers ideas as well as me for next year. Number three, be sure to go to my Facebook page, A Classroom Diva, and click the like button. That way you're the first to know if I post something new or if I'm sharing some new ideas. All right, so once you do those three three things, you will be entered into the drawing for my $15 Target gift card, and I will announce the winner on Christmas Day. Be sure to tune in for my Christmas Day vlog and giveaway announcement, and good luck to everyone. Happy holidays. Bye.